Alright guys, how's it going? Today we'll have a quick video and that just answers one of the questions I've been getting asked over the last couple of weeks and that is, can my computer run WWE 2K15? So ever since the game came out on the PC, a lot of people have been asking us this question and sending us specs to their computer just seeing if it's possible to run the game before they actually go out and buy it. So if you want to check that your computer is capable of running the game, there is a website that you can actually go to and I'll link you to it in the video description. It's called Can You Run It? And from there you can just download a little app that'll run on your computer and just tell you what is up to scratch and whether or not it's capable of running the game. So before we get to that, you can see the minimum settings actually listed here for the game. So we've got a Core 2 Duo along with 4GB of RAM, so that is the minimum settings. If you do have them, you should be able to run the game, but you may have a few issues in terms of slowness and lag because these are minimum settings. However, if you meet the recommended settings, then you should be able to play the game pretty much fine at that point. You shouldn't really have any slowdown. And the, the recommended settings are actually a Core 5, i5 along with 8GB of RAM. So as long as you meet them settings, I think you'll be much better off actually running the game where at the minimum settings you may have a few issues. Now, to just double check it, what we're going to do is click Can You Run It? And then from there, I've already done this, so I'll just refresh computer information. It gives you the option for an automatic detection, which is run through Java. But if you're not updated the latest version of Java, you may have a few issues with that. So what I would do is download the desktop app and just click the start button and that'll download a really small file which downloads really quickly so just click on save file and once that's downloaded we'll just quickly run that click next install and there we go that is installed so click on finish and then once you've done that the website should update automatically and that'll just tell you what is going on with your PC and whether or not it's actually capable of running the game or if you're going to have some issues. So there we go, the page is reloaded and you can see that minimum and recommended is both green so we shouldn't have any issues running the game on my PC. If you want more detailed information or if you do see any red at the top then when you scroll down you'll see whether or not you meet each setting. So we've got the video card which is green, CPU, RAM, operating system, free disk space and the sound card, everything meets the specifications so I shouldn't have any issues running it. If you see any red on here then it means that you do have a problem but what the website actually does is list some other alternatives that you can actually go out and buy just to upgrade your PC so that is then capable of running the game. So we'll just switch over to recommended and you can see everything is green in there too. So that is basically it, that's how you check to see if you can run the game or not. So do this before you go out and buy it and then it saves you having any issues and not being able to run the game. And again, if you see any red, it'll give you some alternatives so you can go out and just upgrade your PC so that it is capable of running the game. So guys, I hope this video has helped you out. I hope it's been helpful. And until next time, catch you later.